Hey guys, I've got a pretty cool video for you today. Um, this video is going to be be about how to get any um, how to get ROMs on any emulator, which I know a lot of people have trouble with. And I'm not going to be using any SSHing. All you need is going to be your device. Um, as you see, if you've been following my videos, um, you'll see my whole setup is differently. I re-jailbroke it because I was having some problems with City and stuff, and so I kind of like thin thin some of the things I didn't need out so it works a lot better now for me. Um you're gonna need two things. You're gonna need your um so or you're gonna need a few things. You're gonna need Safari download manager, which you can get um from Cydia, cracked, be your iPhone repo or to buy it or something like that, you know, that whole thing. Um iFile, it's the same you get you can get it off be your iPhone cracked. And um your emulator, which you can find one like the Game Boy one is GPS GPS phone. I think that's the coolest one, but whichever one you want, I th I'm, think this will work for all of them. Um, so you can op open up your emulator. I'm just going to show you that I only have I only have Pokemon Leaf Green on there now, and I'm going to show you how I got another one. So I'm going to go into my Safari and. I'm already at the website here. So you're going to want to go to doproms.com. Now, you're, once you're there, you want to go over to the side here and pick your type of um, emulator thing you're running on. So mine is Game Boy Advance. I'm going to open that up. And also see my cool little thing up there. You can get off Cydia that I made. Um, anyway, we're gonna scroll down here. You can see there's 27,000 ROMs here, so that, I mean that's a good. If you can't find it there, it's probably I don't know if they have it. So I'm gonna search Pokemon. I'm just gonna get Pokemon Fire Red or another Pokemon game, I guess. So now, um, see. You'll see all these ROMs here and there are zip files and everything, so you're just going to want to click poke the game you want. You're going to click download ROM right there. Just download ROM. It'll bring you, it'll bring it to another web page where you're going to have to click it again. And then you're going to want to click that. Click download. And you're going to want to wait for that to download itself. And once it's downloaded, you're going to want to um, just close out of Safari here. And you're going to want to go into iFile. Let's find where iFile is. Right here. And then you're going to want to go to var your main slash area and then var click on mobile and then into see it's library I believe yeah and then you want to see you're going to see a downloads there open that up and you're going to see that um, you have this one here you're going to want to unarchive it let that do its thing there and then once that's done, you're going to want to click edit and select that one there, the .gba one or dot .whatever. You're going to do copy slash link. Click done here. Go back to your library. Back to mobile. Now you're going to want to click media. And you're going to want to scroll down to ROMs. Find which one you're using. Mine is the GBA. And then I'm just going to do um, edit. And then click this thing in the corner there again. And click paste going to copy it into there and then once this is done you can delete it from your downloads if you don't want it to take up dual space um, and that's about all the time I have once you do that you'll be able to open it up and start playing your game that's how to get any ROM for any emulator without using SSH or anything PM me if you have any questions and please subscribe